Look at this, blue sky. What's going on guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. We got Mr. Ty here and the muddy rope. We had to uh, pull a few trailers out after the weekend there on Sunday. There was a surprise rainstorm on Sunday that we were not expecting. Oh, so yeah, it was a hefty one. I woke up and the whole trailer was shaking and there's some lightning and, and awning got ripped off, but you know, we're still alive. So anyways, today we still have that minivan. We did jump it once. Hopefully we can jump it again. And if not, we still have the Suzuki and the F-150. So we're just gonna take out the trash real quick. These have been sitting over here. Ty moved them over, other Ty with the skits here before the weekend. So we're gonna see what the old F-150's got. This thing's a pulling machine. She went mudding the other day and then thank God it was still raining, washed most of the mud off, but that's why I keep this hitch on. If anyone rear ends me, it's their fault. <laughs> Not to pull from a spare tire <laughs> three years ago. Uh, oh, yeah, we did that, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you'll learn and live, right? How are we going to yank this thing out? So, that looks like a good spot. Try spinning around. Yeah, yeah. What is yanker? So much friggin' plastic everywhere. All right, let's hook her up and give her a yank. All right, is he going to go up? Uh, Easy on this one, or you think he's gonna give her a good yank here? Hopefully, uh, full out. Let's see what he's got. If it was a Dodge, it would have got stuck. Oh yeah, the Dodge would have blew a tranny. <laughs> one in the back. So we got an issue here. Five pancakes with many men in two vehicles. Good thing we got a rope and a cord. Right, exactly. We'll the Perfect. Two vehicles, twice as fast as that one. And uh, see if we can make this thing fly. Perfect. I still got two sets of tires for this F-150, so I'm gonna keep it for a little bit until we burn those ones off. That one will jump off. It jumped backwards when Marcus jumped it. Oh, is this the one that Marcus jumped? Yeah. The rear end's a little funky, but... Alright, let's hook her up to the other one, then uh, keep going. Perfect. Alright, there's no hitch on this thing. Let's smash the window. Why are you standing so far away? Oh, I gotta get the run into it. <laughs> that's how we're gonna that's how we're gonna tow her home we should throw some of this plastic in here too <laughs> uh thank god for this rope this is a yankum rope i think she's rated for 18 or 19 thousand pounds this is the best rope i've ever had she is incredible three quarter inch 30 foot 19 thousand pounds if you guys want to check it out there is a discount code below but she's great for pulling on stuff all right Let's see if we can yank this one 10 times faster than that little, uh, little Chevy. That's what I thought he was gonna do on the first one. I think that Jeep has seen better days. Might be able to put a front bumper on and be street legal. The next car. <laughs> I love hearing that turbo spool up. Good sound. That was a better pull. <laughs> How was that? That was way better. <laughs> Shows you how strong this rope is, eh? I was just saying that the uh, Jeep has seen better days, but if we put a front <laughs> bumper on it, it might be my next car. Yeah, hey, this one's for grass. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right, one more car. Let's see if we can make the other Let's see one. what, yeah, how can we pull that one? Upside down. <laughs> and last, last but not least, the old Pontiac. I don't know if you guys remember George the Monkey here. 
he survived. He's a little moistly right now, but he'll dry out. So the other cars went super well. So we're just gonna drag this one completely sideways. What are your thoughts? Ah, uh, it's gonna just give a good slide. I think uh, <laughs> good Ford will just pull her nice and straight and into the sunset. She is a nice Ford, eh? The old EcoBoost. This thing will pull, pull anything. Pull you right out of the right out of the grave. Maybe we should put him in the window, because <laughs> he probably will end up somewhere. Got your paint, sorry. Yeah, what's the paint? Pay a lot of money for that. <laughs> yeah, you good? We're good. Put George in there. You good to drive, bro? Perfect. Hold on. Oh. Let's see. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. Is that good? That's good. Perfect. <laughs> George is ready. Let's yank away. Come on, George! Oh, George! He's in there good. All right, let's check on George. Oh, he's still in there. All right, we gotta be safe about Georgie here. <laughs> I don't know what happened. He's, he's, not, he's not crushed yet. <laughs> we gotta save our buddy. There's an easy way to fix this. Let's we'll roll it back over. <laughs> Probably not by hand, but let's throw it over. Oh, you gotta give the uh, Brad kick. <laughs> Two footer. <laughs> Come on, Roof. Fighting back! <laughs> that pulled pretty nice, eh? Yeah, it was perfect. I was just waiting for the rope to snap and the clevis to go through my window. I was not expecting the, uh, whoa! Not expecting the, uh, to go up on two wheels. That's the Ford power for you. <laughs> All right, let's uh, yank her back over and put her in the scrap pile there. George is safe to roll now. What's up, buddy? Pump it. I think the rope bounced off. I'll just pull it this way now. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Let's go for number two. Georgia! I think he's squished this time. I think that's game over for Georgie. Man, that monkey's a crazy driver. <laughs> Georgie's dead. I don't know what he's doing back there. <laughs> oh, no, he's dead. Is he dead? Georgie, Georgie's dead. There's his arm. Oh, God. <laughs> that is not in the cab. Code 4, call Bradley. Call Brad. Bring the chopper, Brad. Guy took the cat off, but apparently just the muffler fell off. Beauty! This is what the underside of a car looks like, guys. Not too much to it. As you can see, this is a little snapped off, but alright, let's uh, rock her back over, see if we can get that van going, and uh, see if we can send her to space. Jump it? Too bad uh, Georgie can't jump that van. I guess he's... He might be able to. Maybe he just needs a little dust off. <laughs> Might be able to put his head on in there, that's all. <laughs> you never know. Come on, Georgie. Yeah, it's not looking too good there, Mark. Georgie, you dead man. You dead? 
I think he's hurting. You gotta see if there's a pulse. Oh god. I'm, I'm afraid to uh, flip him over. <laughs> oh, blew his bounty open. Sorry, Georgie. We'll give him a shallow grave. There you go. Alright, that was a little sad, but uh, we'll, find, we'll find another driver. So Let's pull that van out. Or attempt to and jump it. We're good. I didn't get the van. All set. Let's see if this thing starts. We got the no-co back on. Oh, 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 How's it smell? Or puke. <laughs> like rotten. Dirty oh, oats. there. Found the key. That's the one. Yep. There we go. Oh yeah. Runs like a charm. We still gotta move it. We gotta move it though. Oh. Oh, did you get a soaker? We're good. Ugh. Oh, I need my COVID mask. <laughs> All right, pull her forward or backwards. Won't it be easier to go through this way? Mm. That's a pretty delicious hey, smell in here. Sunroof open? Uh, oh, it smells nice. Oh, just to there apparently. Nope. Oh. It smells Dang. like stale butt. Uh, Definitely would have been easier to go through this door. <laughs> Less than my clothes. Alright, maybe go backward, turn left, and then go forward and turn right. There you go. I can't believe we jumped this thing already. Don't, yeah, that's good. Don't end up in the puddle. What a great van. <laughs> oh my God. Look at this thing. Eggs everywhere. Look at the backfire. Poo, poo, poo. Oh, he's stuck in there now. That's gross. Mr. Sagge. All right, well, we got two flat back tires. Are you going to puke? Yeah, that's gross. Well, I got to go in there next. Get an air so. freshener in there. <laughs> uh, let's see if this thing runs when I take the NOCO off. Yep. Yeah. Well, I will bring this thing with me in case I stall it for when I stall at the top of the hill. We'll move my truck out of the way so it doesn't get run over. And uh, yeah, things really tick. It's a backfire. It's the quietest backfire ever. All right, we'll get the gear and let's do this. This thing is quite the smelly piece of art. So we got the GoPro, got the strap, the launch o -matic. We got the Skydio drone just setting up here. This thing's cool, they just updated it. So when you come in for a landing, it looks for this logo and it'll land by itself on the logo. So we're just syncing the GPS. If you guys haven't checked out Scadio yet, there is a link below. These things are unreal, especially for follow mode. So I'm just gonna let that sync up, wait for old die guy here and see if we can get a little bit of air. I know this thing's not gonna go very far, so I wouldn't worry about standing on the other side. I'd probably just stand on top of the old Hyundai there. That's probably your best bet. Oh, you want to kick it for Brad? Yeah, oh, it's fighting back. It's fighting back. <laughs> Thing's sturdy. All right, we're ready to fly. Let's do this. <laughs> Having problems? Struggling already. Man, 
couldn't handle the smell of the egg. It does not smell well. That is bad. Made that move. Top of the hill here. Uh, I think that's all she has. Can't get up the hill. Might have to jump it backwards. I wondered why he was so good at backing up vehicles. No. I don't think she's gonna make it to even the ramp. <laughs> she's gonna make it to even the ramp. I think it's it's done. I'm impressed. I was uh I was a doozy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's exactly where we're going. <laughs> Blow a tire. It's coming out pretty good. I would not want to be in that car. Nope. Well, that turned out pretty good. I think it went the same distance as it did the first time, actually. It only hit the, the side there. I wanted to go further up the hill, but obviously we don't have anything to push us any higher. So I didn't want it to be too good. This van's not amazing or anything, but uh, let's uh, check out the damage. I would have definitely put money on that. I wouldn't even make up the ramp when it was coming down. <laughs> The yeah, way it was, the way it was sounding. I know it didn't sound too good, but it was taken off pretty well. Well, that's just the rad tire. You know, sometimes you gotta put a little oil in the rad, super lube that. But yeah, like the first time, I'm pretty sure it landed right there or right there. So pretty much Perfect. the same. But uh, oh, the airbag went off this time. That's good. Two for one for your money on this one. Yeah, two for. <laughs> oh, my GoPro's even here. <laughs> oh, it shut off though. Hopefully we got that video. It smells better in here now. It doesn't smell like doesn't... eggs anymore. It smells like airbag. Oh, I hate the air. I rather the eggs than the airbag. <laughs> we got a brand new one of these if anyone wants it. BMW. Isn't this a minivan? <laughs> Does BMW make the thing too? Can't forget the old Launchomatic. This sport, I had an old one. Buddy built it, looked awesome. There were shingles, he even rode on it. Someone stole it. I couldn't oh. believe it. So now I just went with this one. It's got nails in it. So make sure you get your tetanus shot. But yeah, I'm glad that turned out well. Hopefully, we got the GoPro and the drone shot. We'll check that out later. But uh, for now, I don't know what we're gonna do next, but 
I know this weekend we're headed up north. We're going to get a bunch of mudding videos and then we're going to destroy some cars at Sean's house. So that's going to be pretty wild. I'm pretty excited for that. And hopefully in the meantime, we'll get rid of a bunch of these cars, get some new cars and just keep on keeping on. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you Ty for coming out. Let's, uh, let's go get some chicken wings. Wing night. See you later. <laughs>